I made $15,560 in three months selling options. That's an average of $5,186 a month. In this video, I will give you three reasons why you should consider selling options as well. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Johannes Bartel and I share my financial journey on this channel. I tell you about my financial mistakes and also my success stories. Today, I wanna to talk about options trading once again. On my recent videos, I realized that a lot of people like fast money. They wanna go all in on AMC with an option trade and make $8 million within a couple hours. This is not what I'm going to talk about in this video. I'm going to share some ideas to why I believe everybody should understand and utilize the power of selling options. That's one important thing I already said, selling options, not buying. Very important. Why you need options in your life. Reason number one, selling options doesn't need a lot of upfront money to begin with. A quick example is Ford, take a symbol F. If you have $1,500, you can make $20 every single week by selling options on Ford. I know $20 doesn't sound like a lot, but you have to start somewhere. Those $20 you can use for whatever you want. You can pull them out, spend them, you can reinvest them into another stock, you can do whatever you want with it. By the way, $20 a week on a $1,500 investment is 1.3% on your initial investment, a week. If you still believe that's not a lot, Take the $1,500, go to your bank and ask how much interest you will receive on $1,500 in a year. Just for fun. <laughs> Hypothetically, just imagine, this is very unlikely, but the entire stock market doesn't move for an entire year and you are able to sell that option every single week. Same thing, no stock appreciation, you use $1,500 every single week. Guess how much money you will have by the end of the year? $1,040 just in premium. You almost doubled your money. Anyways, I digress. By the way, I wanna mention that I don't endorse Ford. I'm not sponsored by Ford telling you to buy options on Ford. This was just an example to illustrate that you can start with as little as $1,500. If you're still a crybaby and you're saying $20 a week is nothing, you have to change your mindset fast. Getting paid $20 to purchase shares of a company that I'm willing to buy anyways is pretty dope if you ask me. Not only can I get the shares at a discount, I also get paid for it. That's a win-win situation. You can slowly build your portfolio and as soon as it's bigger, who would have thought, the more money you have in your portfolio, the more contracts you can buy, the higher the premiums you'll get. So use that as a motivation and don't laugh at small premiums. I said small premiums, stop laughing. I for sure don't laugh at small premiums. I keep selling my 200 shares of NEO on a weekly basis and I will get my $40 every single week. Those $40 a week add up to $160 every single month. And I'm not adding the stock appreciation. This is just premiums that I receive every single week. Just imagine what you can do with an additional $160 every single month. Those $160 cover my phone bill, my Netflix subscription, flowers for my girlfriend, and even my own Patreon subscription for $7 a month where I can get my own financial moves every single day. Why you need options in your life, reason number two. Before I tell you this gem of a reason, please do me a favor and help this little puppy get his treat. If you like this video and subscribe to the channel, this will release the treat from the powerful YouTube algorithm hand and you will make a puppy very happy. I'll wait. So why you need options in your life, reason two. Selling options is not rocket science. Anybody can learn how to do it. If I can do it, you can do it as well. I already made a video about how I sell options. I think, I always forget, I think it's here. But like when I flip it, it must, it must be here. Click here. If you haven't seen the video yet, this is like more in details how to sell options, but I'll try to put it into two sentences. Are you ready? If you are selling a put option, you are agreeing to purchasing 100 shares in the future at a specific price and for that obligation, you will receive a premium into your bank account. If you sell a call option, you agree to sell 100 shares of a specific company in the future at a specific price and for that obligation, you receive a premium into your bank account. Again, if you need a video that explains it a little bit better and longer, here's the video. And if you still need information, don't worry about it. Just leave a comment below and I'll try to answer it as soon as possible. Why you need options in your life, reason number three. Selling options doesn't require a lot of time. You can still keep your day job and secretly build a portfolio that in the future can, you know, pay all of your bills and then you can decide if you still wanna work at your job or pursue another dream. 
I'm not implying that everybody hates their job, but in reality, a lot of people do, which sucks. Mm, but I need to understand the entire stock market, which is very time consuming, otherwise I will lose money, right? Mm, wrong. I don't understand every single detail of the entire stock market, but what I do know is what affects my portfolio within the next couple months. What I'm trying to say is you don't have to do a fundamental analysis of every single company in the entire world to understand the stock market and then figure out what you wanna buy and what you wanna sell. Focus on one specific company that you believe will be around for the next 15 to 20 years and start there. Start investing your time and read and learn more about the company, what is what are the benefits, what are the competitors, and that's all you have to do. Focus on one company. That's exactly the reason why I invested into NEO a while ago because I truly believe that NEO will be around for the next 10, 15 years. There are a lot of reasons why I bought NEO shares, but I don't wanna go into details right now. The only thing I wanna share is this. I like the company, that's why I bought 200 shares of NEO, and I'm, I will continue to sell covered calls on those 200 shares, way out of the money, which will pay me 40, $30 every single week, which I will then reinvest into other companies, or I just wait till my buying power is strong enough to buy another 100 shares, which then allows me to sell three contracts, which which automatically brings me to $60 a week. You get the point. I believe in the company and that it will be around for the next 10 to 15 years, which is why I have it. But I'm also not married to the share. So if I sell a covered call way out of the money and all of a sudden there's a spike, I'm not too mad if I sell at a profit. How did you make $15,000 in three months? So the companies I used to make $15,560 in three months were Apple, Tesla, Neo, and Riot. Everybody knows Tesla and just as an example, you can get paid $1,200 a week if you have $58,000 to invest. Now here's the thing, I fully believe that Tesla will take over the energy sector which therefore, you know, elevate their stock price by a lot within the next five to 10 years, which is why I'm investing into Tesla every single week and also use, uh, oh my God, selling put options on Tesla to receive the high premium. And even if I have to buy 100 shares of Tesla, I'm not mad at it. But if I don't get assigned, I make $1,200 a week, which I could technically buy two shares of Tesla with. I mentioned NEO three times in this video, but I continue to sell my Neo, my 200 shares of NEO every single week to generate $40 every single week. Okay, next is Riot. Riot is highly volatile and very risky if I just like put it out there like that. like. I just wanna make sure that you understand, don't get greedy when you see the high premiums that Riot pays because it's so volatile, because you don't need a lot of money to invest into Riot and you get like $100, $200 a week with like a $4,000 investment. Here's the thing, Riot is a Bitcoin mining company, so it correlates exactly with the Bitcoin price. So if Bitcoin drops tomorrow five or 10%, Riot will do the exact same. If you are a subscriber to this channel, you have seen my other videos and you know that I believe in Bitcoin and that we will see another mini bull run by the end of the year, which is why I hold 3,300 shares of Riot right now, which I just, you know, sell covered calls on way out of the money because I don't wanna sell them right now because I truly believe that we're gonna see a mini bull run, which will also bring up the price of Riot and that's why I'm having Riot shares. At the current price, I'm able to generate 900 to $600 every single week by selling my 3,300 shares as a covered call. Next up is Apple. With Apple, I have a love and hate relationship because I bought a leap option on Apple at its highest point, which means I'm down 40% at the moment on my option. I'm not too concerned though, because I know I have a year left to make money with that option. On top of that, I don't need the $2,000 that I paid for that specific contract so I'll just let it run. That is it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you wanna get started with selling options right now, sign up with Webull. You can get free stocks worth $1,600. On top of that, if you have cryptocurrency laying around that's not making you any money, go to BlockFi right now and get up to $250 when you sign up. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. That was so weak.